Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to understand the demonstration of network intrusion detection project using machine learning algorithm. So as far as the network intrusion is concerned, so many times whenever your computer is in the, the network or there is some sort of internet or some uh, computer network is there. So there can be an intrusion attack happening on your system or maybe in your network. Now, in order to detect that whether uh, it is an intrusion or it's a normal thing, so whenever the data transaction is happening between uh, the so many computers under the network, so there may be some possibilities where some attacks or some uh, thing is intentionally done to hack the information or to steal some data from the remote computer. So in order to detect that whether something is intrusion or something is normal thing, so we can use the machine learning algorithms to train the model and once the model is trained then such trained model can detect the intrusion happening in the network now for that purpose we are using the uh, data set and uh, particularly speaking we are having the so many entries in the data set and so many features uh, for this data set like uh, the protocol used for the communication this type of service and duration and all those stuff and uh, we are pre-processing this data and then we are training the model so here multiple algorithms are used to train the model uh, machine learning model and their performance is evaluated their accuracies are calculated and uh, then we are uh, giving the real-time packet to test in order to test the real-time packets we have stored some uh, packets in this uh, csv file to test and their expected outcome uh, is stored in this particular uh, file so that we can compare whether the prediction is correct or not now once we uh, train the model and once we run the code we can open the google uh, chrome and we can hit the localhost 5000 so that we can visualize the project secondly uh, as far as the backend part of this project is concerned its uh, programming language is python and the flask framework of python is used to create web application and at the front end side we are using html and css to uh, create the web st uh, site or that structure of the website now once we run we have to hit this localhost colon uh, 5000 once we hit that then we'll be on this particular page this is just a static page home page and then we can click on train model uh, uh, this particular tab but this takes uh, time because it actually trains the model and it will take time so i have opened it already so this is the train so first of all uh, we are calculating the important features so there as you said uh, we see we saw that there are so many features available in the data set but which feature is more important so that importance score is calculated using the random forest uh, algorithm and we are here we are getting the their importance score versus the features and then first 15 top 15 features we have selected to train the model then uh, we have used the k nearest neighbor algorithm and its accuracy uh, is around 99% for the training data set and for the testing data set it's 99.16 percent so it's very good accuracy secondly for the uh, Bernoulli's navy based classifier we have 90.71 percent accuracy for training data set and for the testing data set 90.67 percent and the network which has or the uh, model which has performed better is this decision tree classifier for this data set its accuracy is 100 percent for training data set and for the testing data set the accuracy is calculated around 99.47 percent so it's good and uh, among these three we can uh, conclude that the decision tree classifier is having the highest accuracy then we can click on the test packet and here actually we have to enter the packet and then these three algorithms will do their prediction and they will tell us whether it is the anomaly whether it's an intrusion or it's a normal thing now in order to do that uh, we are having some packet stored in this particular thing so i will copy let's say i will copy this first packet and then i will paste the first number is the packet id so we'll remove that and then i will test it so in this case all three algorithms are saying it's an anomaly, uh, anomaly or it's an intrusion and the same is the thing if you say uh, this expected.csv so this packet number is anomaly but uh, this packet number is normal so let's go and test this particular packet number so this is uh, this packet number i think so i will copy this packet and then i will uh, paste in the system 
and also I need to deal with this first number I should remove it and then I will test it so this time you see it's a normal package all three algorithms are saying that but as I said the uh, accuracy of burn all is now is around 90 percent so out of 100 10 predictions will be definitely incorrect in this case so every time this result will not be same for all these algorithms it will be different based on their individual accuracies so that's all about the uh, complete implementation of this project in case you need the help or support or some core of this particular project then you can check the description box under this video thank you